I don't want to build just any bamboo bike. I want to build the ultimate bamboo bike. And we want a great looking frame. I'm Patrick and I'm a cycling photographer. One of the best perks about my job is that I get to see some of the latest and greatest bikes as they come onto market. I get to shoot them and sometimes ride them, which is brilliant. One of the latest trends that I really like is gravel biking. I love the idea that you can get away from the traffic, get out riding single track, gravel roads, but that they're also useful on the road. So I thought, I want to get one. But I didn't want to buy a gravel bike. I want to build a gravel bike. I love the idea of doing something locally and building it with sustainable materials, which is why we're here at the Bamboo Bicycle Club. So we're all about people coming in, building a bike for themselves, being creative and taking ownership of the process. So what we really need to think about is what components we're going to use and how we're going to make the frame work really, really well for them. How we're going to have a stiff frame, a comfortable frame, really good compatibility, and then we're going to start building. So first thing, you're going to pick your bamboo tube in for your frame. We're going to try and create an engineered bamboo. So we're going to split it all down and rejoin it and therefore we can create unique aero shapes and we can also improve the performance. That's going to give us something completely different that's never been done before. So we've, we've selected all our tubes for the front triangle. We've done our first mighty cut on the seat tube and we're trying to position now the down tube into the jig. We've mitered all our, our tubes so we've got a really, really good fit between them. We've also run our internal cables. Similarly to a carbon frame, we're going to use a, a hand layup process and that will create a really, really strong bond for the bamboo. We're going to glue everything up and centralise everything on the jig. So we've left our frame to dry. The lugs that we did the other day have now set. Uh, and obviously when you hand wrap the lugs, there, there are imperfections. So what we've been doing is sanding that down with paint. It's looking exactly how I wanted it. And today we're gonna to fit all the components onto the frame and get it ready to ride. I cannot wait. First ride impressions, wow. I mean, the bike feels amazing. On the tarmac, it's really fast, really responsive, really stiff where it needs to be. And then when I've come down on this canal path, those wide 47 mil tires, the rims, all the components working together to make it a really smooth, supple, fast, responsive ride. Now I'm gonna take it to some single track mountain bike trails and see how it copes with that. And just to give myself a little bit of extra grip, I'm gonna stick some slightly more knobby tires on and we'll see how we get on there. So I set out to build an ultimate gravel bike. And to be honest, I think I've succeeded. It's not just this bike is brilliant. It's one of my favorite bikes I've ever ridden. It's also that pride of ownership that comes with building something yourself. It's hard to believe that just a couple of months ago, this was just a few pieces of bamboo. Now it's been shaped into this brilliant gravel bike. So if you've ever thought of working a similar project yourself, maybe building a custom bike, I highly recommend it. It's one of the best things I've ever done.